Hello everyone, this is Carolyn from Carolyn's Musings on Etsy and Facebook. I have come today for uh, a video to show you how to do this uh, mini envelope tab binding journal. Um, let me just give you a peek at what we'll be making. We have top tucks. Plenty of journaling space. I use six envelopes with this. Pockets. More pockets. Journaling space. Um, I created um, a flip out here with um, more journaling space. Another pocket. This just holds little journaling spaces. We have side pockets, journaling space, another side pocket. There's lots of pockets. Pocket here, and then here we have a top to hold a tag, and whoops. More journaling space. And another top tuck. And that is what we'll be making. So if you'd like to see how this is done, just please stick around. What we'll need is, I have six envelopes again. Um, six envelopes. Um, some fabric I have just cut into little strips and um, some Fabri-Tac glue. Since this is my now sixth video, um, I had already folded these um, envelopes, but these envelopes um, I believe are five by sevens. These are like card envelopes, five by sevens. <clears throat> On my first page, I just glued um, my um, envelope flap shut for the first one. For the second one, I just glued down the center and left top tucks. This one, I folded inward and left pockets here on each side. This envelope, my pockets here, and this one I just closed right up. And let's see, yeah, this one is the one I left top. Um, I believe um, we can use this for. Our top for our tags on the top. Oops. And on this side. Sorry, I'm not staying in screen. My mind is totally concentrating on whether the um, camera is going to be right this time. Hmm, there's something wrong with my punch. Um, what I seem to have trouble with on this phone is uh, making sure it's widescreen for YouTube. Okay, so that one's totally closed. This one. And this one has our outside pockets. This one has our top tucks. This one, I believe, yes, this is the one I want. Um, here, I believe I'll try to use this one. Here, I will make a notch. Um, so you can see that this will be um, not having luck with these today. I hope everyone's having a great day. I know here, um, where I'm from, it's usually um, snow, freezing uh, in, in February, but we had 70 degrees yesterday. We have 65 and rain today, but 
the Lord knows best. So I'm just thankful. Okay, I think I fixed those. Okay, so you can fold your envelopes whichever way you'd like. Um, I hope I gave you some ideas there um, without actually doing them. And then uh, what we will do next is I always close up my first page. Okay, so then what you do is you take your tabs and you put, you're going to put three tabs on the first page. Um, another thing I guess I could say is make sure that you have each envelope turned the correct way. And you just put three tabs. You put it on the top and you'll put it in the middle. And you'll put it on the bottom on this first one. And then you will turn it over. You will line up your second envelope with the first one. And on this one, you're only going to do two tabs. And you're going to line your tabs up in the middle of where you just did your other three tabs. And you're only gonna need two, as I said, I think, <laughs> on this one. promised this video so long ago and I'm so sorry it's taken me so long and you flip this one over okay and your first three tabs that you did are going to glue to this side of your second page pull them kind of snug And you have your two, so you bring your next envelope and you line it up and you're going to go back and do three tabs again. I'm using the same tab since the last video messed up. I have used so many envelopes trying to get this done that I hurried and looked at the video and then I quickly pulled off the tabs and came back to do it again. Okay, so that's our three. All right, let's look again. Um, try to uh, keep moving everything because this is fabric and the Fabri-Tac comes through. And you just wanna make sure that you have an even space. Um, let me make sure you can see an even space. Um, <clears throat> your gap is even. And I keep doing it so that nothing gets stuck there. And we will flip this one over. And this time, and make sure they're even. And this time, we will glue our two tabs. And then get that off of there. Pull our next envelope and do two tabs. I'll be a pro at this by the time I get this video done. Here and here. Flip it over and then come back and glue your three tabs again. And I forgot to say, make sure your envelopes turn the right way each time. Pull it snug. And next envelope, we are back to three tabs.
hope I'm not going too fast. I hope I'm explaining this well. So that's our three tabs. And we turn it over. And we will glue our two tabs. <clears throat> you have to move the fabric wiggle it out of your way and then on your last page you just take your last page and you simply turn it over and line it up let me get that piece of paper off of there line it up and glue it to the back and snugly. Okay. Get that out of the way. And then, um, here we go. Still kind of sticky in there. There you go. And so on the last one, I kind of wanted to give you some more ideas. This is the one I did before that the video didn't take, but I didn't think to uh, try to pull off the tabs really quick. <clears throat> so on this one, of course, this is our front page, and I created this as the front or for the front. And then here, um, I had this, as I've said in an, another video, I always print my digitals to make sure the color it looks well and, um, and they print properly. And so I thought I could take this envelope and make a tuck spot, glue it, and make a tuck spot here, and then a flip out with more storage over here. <laughs> and then, I think there was one more I did right here. So I had another scrap. <clears throat> I just uh, cut it to size and just scored right here. And I thought it could go in like this. And it would be another flip out. And I have this here to make two little pockets there. And then another thing I thought would be really good is um, I have these scraps. So I thought, you know, because you're going um, in and out and in and out of your pockets, so I thought it would be good, kind of like a reinforcer, so that your <clears throat> envelope doesn't tear. Okay, and so that's how you do the envelope uh, tab binding. I hope I explained it well enough, and I thank you so much, all of you, for watching. And I hope you have a truly blessed day. Bye-bye.